I do very much、uh, apologize、uh, to, to everybody who are looking on in my head <laughs> and also to myself. I did very much passionately <laughs> Dharma talk by myself who nobody listened. <laughs> so I start from the beginning. Yes. What I started to talk about in the beginning is、um, what we human beings、yeah, in this time and age have to develop ourselves. It's a wisdom. At the, at the, now, when we look to the world, With wisdom or without wisdom, it will be totally different. You look the different. The world totally different. The view is. Because, okay, human being now, for a long time, for a long time, okay, they never used the brain. <laughs> When the authority says something, which means authority means the government, media, and studies, the studies, you know, people who has a, let's say, doctor or scholar for scholarship, whatever, professor, or even they are giving the money from the company <laughs> and say something. They believe it. This, how many times we've been fooled by the government and media and those authorities? <laughs> and the people still don't, still don't learn about it. How many, how many times people made a war by? By following the authorities, including just including like a、uh, Iraqi work. Iraqi work, do you, do you remember the girl called Naira came、uh, on the BBC or something? BBC, <laughs> yeah, BBC or something, and said, Hey, hey Iraqi、uh, soldiers are, are killing the babies in the hospital, and, and I'm the witness. She was like 14, 13. She's crying in the TV, and everybody, you know, you know, everybody gets angry. And the United States people who agreed to bomb the Iraq, and Iraq, and many people in Iraq, they, got, they killed, bombed. This is what happened. And fortunately, people found out. That the girl called Naira, the name was fake, and she never, it was never been lived in a Kuwait. <laughs> and how could she, she see it, you know? It was just、uh, fake, you know, on the, on the media. But how many fakes on the media? Right? And this is what a very famous、uh, experiment. It was in about 70 years ago, just after the Second World War.、Um, it's called、um, Milligram Experiment. That there were, people are told to put the electric shock when the, the person in the other side of the world, world and gave a wrong, wrong, wrong answer about any, some questions. And then he was told by authorities that this is the right thing to do, so you have to do it. And、uh, it was written there more than 300 volts of the, of the electric is dangerous. Or whatever, 450 is like almost dying or something. And the other side, of, people in the other side of the world, they,、uh, they shout or they scream, and、uh, then. Then, when they have start having questions, 
ask, ask the authority, and then the, uh, somebody looks like authority, and they say, he, he can he, uh, do it, you have to do it. Then more than 60% of the people put into the 450 volt, which is killing, dying, and harming 300, 300, more than 300 volt, which is like a very, very shocking, all of them down. Well, and also in recently they did uh, some similar experiment uh, for the uh, pilot, some, I think pilot education or something. If, if they do something very dangerous, button push bot dangerous button to, to make airplane crash when the pilot said do it same many many of the people they follow the pilot because of the authority do you know what this means this means people stop the brain to judge whether it's right or wrong, when they hear something from the authority, this is this means if you don't, if you just blindly follow what I say, or because I'm wearing the robe or something, <laughs> it's wrong. <laughs> don't do it. Don't blindly follow. You, uh, wisdom only comes from stand on your feet. <laughs> Judgment, right or wrong, you have to, and this, you have to, decide, you have to have based on your own feet. And this is why this is important that in Tausanga, that you can s get body sense and you can judge from the key body sense either what is right, what is wrong. So, okay. Do you know what I want to say? I want to say about uh, just a little bit. I don't want to talk so much about about uh, whatever the politics or whatever but about the corona thing don't <laughs> follow the government don't I mean I don't say don't follow because you might get arrested or something <laughs> but don't believe <laughs> how many times don't believe the media just simply <laughs> simply Clearly, no. I don't know, um, like in Japan, only, <laughs> for example, in Japan, 10,000 people dies by influenza, and uh, about 100 people die from the corona, and we e don't even know if it's really death from the corona, because the CRP test is written on a 3060 36 pages that this does not um, prove that if it's corona or not. <laughs> this test doesn't prove and they using this test for the people who passed away, to who died and, test, and use this test and, and they say it's corona. What is it? Only just to have a brain, you know? That's all I want to say. I want to say just in our brain. It's not even wisdom. It's not even wisdom. It's just simple fact and just just judge from the simple fact who is what is right and what is wrong. That's it. <laughs> okay. I don't want to speak more because people who believe media and um, media and governments and studies, whose authorities. When it's uh, during the uh, Second World, and I was uh, uh, sure I was put into jail or something, and 
be called that you're not you're not and you're anti the government <laughs> okay and now people call me your conspiracy theorist <laughs> and, and they try to teach me you know um, stop it i mean i don't mind it but anyway i stop about this but important is that we have at least brain to awaken at least brain but we have to have wisdom and uh, <clears throat> same as religion so many long information the, the religion gave to the people Um, when the religion become the religion, it become it become not religion anymore. <laughs> it become not a true religion anymore. Become. <laughs> Do you understand what I mean? They lose the, the true spirit. Because you know why they use like government use or media use or the to, to manipulate people you know we have been manipulated human being has been manipulated why they manipulate the purpose of, purpose of to manipulate other people the people is to use them okay <laughs> right same in a religion when they put authority they make a hierarchy and they put authority and they and to use people not to help people not to raise their wisdom not to rescue them to, to use them okay that's what happened and what that has been happening and that's what's happen, happening now and don't let it happen anymore <laughs> one enlightened they enlightened they get wrong by enlightenment opposite of enlightenment is what uh, stu stupidity stupidity or negativity And when we, when we, when, we, when the people hear this enlightenment and stability, negativity, automatically people think this way. Okay, I am this. I am stupid. I'm negative. And somebody guru is enlightened. He has no stability, no negativity. He's enlightened. Okay. And. Uh, if I practice, I will be enlightened like Guru someday and not stupidity and negativity anymore. This is totally stupid ideas. <laughs> when, when somebody says I'm enlightened and uh, I don't have any more negativity, stupidity, totally fake. <laughs> it's totally fake. Even Jesus, even Buddha, he, those, even those people, both are, are clearly in, in, inside of their heart. Same as us. We have enlightened in our self very clearly, and we have stability, negativity very clearly in both in our heart. And as I said, enlightenment is a body sensation. And one of the body sensation of the enlightenment is, is emptiness. Actually, not only emptiness. And not only emptiness, it's emptiness. Mm. And 
emptiness means dharma body. Uh, emptiness, dharma body. Okay. Uh, we have uh, five bodies, not only a uh, physical body, but we also have a dharma body, which is emptiness. And in, in Tao Sangha, <laughs> we can uh, easily uh, experience the body sen sensation of the, of the dharma body, which is, uh, which is emptiness body. And the light illuminates. direction it means everywhere the emptiness the, the light in, in, uh, illuminates everywhere through from the emptiness dharma body this is this sensation not only sensation you can recognize with the key this happens when you experience the thousand and not in a difficult, not like a, not like a billions of years you have to practice. You can, <laughs> you can very uh, easily, you can easily experience this. This um th today uh, we uh, we had a two days at Tao uh, class and uh, and of course everybody experienced very easily and. Uh, this is in our ourself, not like one day, someday, if we practice. What is wrong is that we are this and we have to go to this. No, 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 no. This is our true reality. But we have stability as well and we of course in Mayana Buddhism it says in the Sutra enlightenment stability negativity is equal is oneness is oneness and by recognizing This is important because if you don't recognize, if you don't recognize, what will happen is that the negativity will control you because you don't recognize. If you recognize, you try to overcome moment to moment. And this increase your wisdom and this will lead you to awaken the emptiness dharma body, light illuminates everywhere. This how okay? We have in, in our heart called uh, Congo Congo heart. Congo means diamond. Just I give you first um, other information, and uh, and one more thing. What is stability or negativity? What is stability or negativity? Uh, clearly, uh, show uh, um, typical stability negativity is it toward toward the law of the universe, principle of the universe. Or to the, for example, as a, as a law of the universe, principle of the universe, cause and effect. It means, if you give love, if you care about other people, other effect, this is cause, okay? You, you care about other people, you give love, you give energy, energy to other people. This is a, um, cause and effect which means result is you get more love you get you get you receive love from Amitabha 
and you get more energy from the universe. This is the principle of the universe. But how many people will do this? <laughs> Why? Because of the doubt. Uh, doubt. It's because of the doubt. Is it true? If, if I give this, do I get really get this? <laughs> the doubt about it, right? And also ignore about it. They don't believe it, they ignore about it, and they don't want to give it, whatever. But they don't really, really, really take it serious. Take it these teachings, I mean, principle of the universe as your responsibility of living. If you be responsible means if you hear the teachings, you do it and you prove yourself and you share with others. This means this means duty. And the important is the duty. Okay? Duty means to be responsible overcoming this stability, doubt. Okay? Because we have, we have stability, we have negativity, we have doubt all the time in our heart. But you see, for example, this dharma or to the people, other people. So you don't give, you don't do it. But every moment you overcome, mm -hmm. and you, you, you live with it, you live with it, continuation. Then you be the, then what you experience is the sensation of the body, of the emptiness of the Dharma, Dharma body, and the light illuminates everywhere. That what? And you even realize that wisdom of Amida Buddha dwells into your Kongo heart, diamond heart that it shines the light of the of the of the Amida Buddha's wisdom in, in your heart you feel it you can even see it we ex and people experience it. I really <laughs> feel frustrated that I cannot see you in direct and let you experience but you can experience okay when it opens and which means this stability and enlightenment is the two wheels of the of the of the of the car. Get these two wheels of the car. And what is the gasoline? What is the gasoline? Gasoline is to be responsible heart. To be judging. To continue overcoming and you live with it, you be as it as a as to follow it, be responsible to the field, be responsible to people, be responsible to others' happiness. And this is duty. And you experience by that wisdom in your heart. Wisdom of the Dharma Buddha, uh, Amida Buddha is in your heart. You can feel it, you can it's illuminate, and also you, you feel Dharma body. You will be developed by the wisdom of Dharmakaya, which uh, Amida Buddha's um, emptiness body and the light illuminates the whole universe and this sensation. But at the same time, don't forget, at the same time, these two other two wheels, two feel and continuation all the time. He and the wisdom keep increasing and let it transform to the field, transform to the world, and to transform to the universe. This is a way of the enlightenment. This is the way of Tao Sangha. Uh, thank you for the um, patient for the first 20 minutes <laughs> about today. And thank you for listening to the Dharma and I'll see you soon.